Hi, I'm Parna Ganesh and I welcome you to my channel Joy Geeks. I create beauty and wellness content here and Elf Cosmetics got launched in India and I know all of us were really excited because it's this wonderful affordable brand from the US which is now available. Uh, I did make a whole video of, you know, the different products and I've shown you a face full of how that worked. But this video is about the lipstick duos that I did genuinely love. This video, I'm going to focus completely on this and tell you what I like about it and if there is anything that I would have preferred it to be different, I will share all of it with you in this video. And actually, that's eight shades watched. Hey, so this uh, is called the Elf Day to Night Lipstick Duo and this is the kind of packaging it uh, came in. And what is unique about it is that it has two shades. There is one shade on top, the other one is in the bottom. It says day on one side and night on one side. Well, that is something they want to call it as day to night, but you could use any of the colors as per your wish. I'm going to take you through all the eight shades. I did get all four shades in full excitement because I tried out one and I liked it but I'm going to tell you what I think of it and if you should go spend 650 once I swatch all four shades. So I'm going to quickly read what they say about it. Elf Day to Night Lipstick Duo is a dual ended lipstick that has a beautiful soft shade for the day and a bolder shade for night. I would love to wear a bold shade the day too. Uh, the Velvety Satin Formula. I have one of those shades. It is velvety and satin, uh, enriched with shea butter and vitamins A, C and E to help nourish and hydrate the lips. You know, uh, you will see in the swatches, when one swipes this, you know, all along my channel, I've been saying makhan like, this really glides like makhan and it just feels so wonderful on the lips. It's very buttery, really buttery. I feel that, is it so buttery that's going to melt off, in fact? I think it, the, the the lipsticks, I just like it. Of course, it has that ultra creamy sheen. And uh, if you want a matte finish, I'm just going to dab it with this and see. Yeah, some of the shine goes off without completely taking off the lipstick. But it's not meant to be a matte lipstick. In fact, I would like to touch that up just to show you. Oh, I just love how it feels on the lip when I apply it. So I will take you through it. Now, um, this is what the lipstick is like and it costs um, 6 It costs 650 I got it for five, less than 500 I think, because I bought it on the launch day when they, you know, gave me the third one free when I bought two. Now, this is 3 grams only but you have two shades and I feel that this packaging is very cute, very travel friendly, especially because you do get two shades and actually I think it's three shades because there are two and you can mix up the two also and make your third one. So they're calling it duo, I'm calling it a triplet. Uh, so I did like this formula, I'm going to continue reading what um, they have to say. So dual ended lipstick with one light and one bold shade. The smooth creamy formula, yes, enriched. Um, the uh, the compact packaging is travel friendly, absolutely. Now, free from parabens and harmful chemicals. And the beauty of Elf is that it is a cruelty free. It is, um, you know, in that sense, a lot of people have always raved about Elf because that a beautiful combination of it being affordable, the quality being really good and that it's a cruelty-free brand, paraben-free brand. Normally, when it becomes paraben-free, I feel that uh, the cost kind of somehow goes up. I don't know what is the correlation, but uh, this is 100% vegan, no animal testing, and uh, so it's totally guilt-free. So isn't that wonderful? Now, I'm sure this is uh, like a lot cheaper in the US, uh, but I feel that even at 600, um, even at 650 I still like it and I'm sure there will be sales so you could wait for the sale and then just go grab it, uh, grab this at that point 
so uh, i will head on with the swatches i think i have given you a fair uh, review uh, does it transfer of course it transfer does it stay long is a good question if you ask me it stays a lot longer than i expected it to be because it's creamy i thought it won't stay for over 2 3 hours but it does stay a good 4 5 hours and according to me if a bullet lipstick stays for 4 5 hours it's like a really good quality lipstick i mean in terms of the long stay of it so let me straight get on with uh, the lipstick swatch ha huh, if you like the look that i have my entire face makeup has been done with all of the elf products i did feature this in that other video and uh, except that in that video i had not added the eyeliner i've added that for this uh video uh you can check that out if you like this it's a very very basic look you want to know what foundation shade suits me concealer all of that is in that video check that out and i also intend to make another video featuring uh, the five lipstick formulas so if that is out i will put that up as a link now to the swatches <laughs> quite tiny as you can see it's not like a full sized bullet and so for sure this uh, is uh, washing me out so i will mix this with the darker shade for it to be slightly nicer for me just like i was saying look the tip has kind of it i'm sure if i open it fully it is too soft it has kind of um broken it is pretty soft so i just mixed the day and night shade and this is what i've got so yeah, if you like nudes and if you are a darker skin tone like mine you still really want to get the shade this is how you can make it look there's something very sweet how can this be so sweet this is sweet this lipstick is sweet i'm taking it off and i'm licking my lips i can just feel the sweetness on my lips how i don't know <laughs> best berries this is the day shade i'm wearing the light muted pink is also moving um you know even this shade broke i am not very happy about it i loved how soft it was in the beginning i know i gushed over 
how wonderful it is and all of that but if it is so soft and i don't think i i rub too hard but it is so soft that if it's going to break the 650 it's a very steep price for this because which means it's almost like 325 bucks for each lipstick and you get a full size lipstick which is about 4 grams and more in so many other brands that was a bummer to be very honest okay this is the darker shade of um, the berries I like the creamy finish but for such a dark shade I would generally avoid having such a glossy look to it. So with these shades I like the lighter colors. Although again I'm going to just kind of dab and see if this works. Yeah. It's a lot better with it looking a little matte. And yeah, it hasn't taken off. It's still not completely matte but less shiny. and has not taken off this lipstick off with the tissue red hot reds let's go with a day shade it's a bright bright red is it the day shade red hot reds quite a bright red but i like red so i'm fine pretty deep red it's uh, the red hot red night shade you have to really be careful it's super super soft which i thought was a pro same thing looks to be a con now because two of my shades kind of broke and that's not a happy thing um apart from that i would say i think the pigmentation is good <clears throat> the cost of 650 i feel i'm sure uh, in the us it'd be some 450 or 500 that would have been nicer um do you should you go for this I think as a novelty this is really nice that you have two shades in one and I really like the packaging. I would say if I didn't have it I would have liked to go for at least one shade and be really careful uh to not, you know, press it even a little hard. Um yeah, in that sense I would say it's not a completely bad buy and if you buy it in the sale definitely you'll have a better deal. So, uh I hope you've seen the other two videos also that I have on health. and um it just goes to show that you can't judge a lipstick completely by just one lipstick sometimes so i often buy two first before i go on and uh you know get more shades to swatch the entire range for you but i'm happy i've got all the lipsticks available here in this range as well so let me know which are your favorite shades in the description box and um uh instagram handle is joy geeks i did share uh, out there that i have got the shades i have got the con- uh, you know the the um, uh, the products to try out i'll let you know so that is a good way for me to stay in touch with you if you're not following me there stay connected with me take care